sub, sub, sub. And I shit my pants right now. I got like Mono Montana deck over here. Uh, not usual, not usual. I don't usually run uh, Monty like at all. Wow, uh, this is horrible. Uh, Travis is a pain in the ass for any Montana users. You would know if you use Montana. Travis is probably the most annoying thing that can happen to you. Now, I don't think he'll go Wraithbot or Sansa here because uh, he, he should save that for Moses. Uh, I don't know how I feel about using Mono Montana. This is like the second game I was running. What's it called? Um, I was running Hurricane and Uluwaru, the deck from the last video, but it wasn't really working as well because there's a lot of Mono All Star going around. Apparently, the new card like I gave All Star fresh of bread. Like, uh, um, what the fuck am I saying? <laughs> Uh, a breath of fresh air because it's like a 7 6 uh, Sowa card, and I mean, that's fairly good. Uh, we prefer Bill Frister, which is cool, and Romana is out of the way. Not that Romana would be a huge threat, but he has very little damage on his hand right now, and getting rid of uh, Romana like that is kind of great. And we did get two life cap. Um, I think uh, his play here is to go rave bot. A rave bot? I got like surely I don't have that much damage available. But I can I think I can make him be in a very weird uh, spot. By just um, let me think. So trap is is like one power, right? Which means that at ten pills, he'd be ten power minus four. Yeah. So all I gotta do is cover the minimum eight. Uh, which means Iris needs to be four pilled and Moses needs to be four pilled. Okay. Now. The troublesome part is that he may Fury Sensei, for sure, he may Fury Sensei. Uh, he goes Rave Bot. He took quite a long time to play as well. Uh, regardless, anyways, what was I saying? What I could do is go Aris here and have a Moses tree peeled. So that'd be 6 build Iris. 7 times 6 plus 4. That's 46. Uh, to cover that, he need to 5 pill. He can't 4 pill. 4 pill would be 45 damage. You think he would 5 pill here? What if he 5 pills? Uh, what's the he might be five billion uh, however if he as much as two pills I get a guaranteed win by holding mr. dark here either dark or iris it doesn't really matter which one so I, I think he's much more likely to cover a 6 pilled Iris than he is to cover, I mean, to go 2 pills or under, you know? So I think uh, my play is to old Dark here. So we're gonna do that. Ooh, he won pills. So that was not... That was not very predictable as a play in general. But, um, regardless, I'm a 5 pill here, and that should guarantee me a tie. Uh, anyways, that was a weird play, because if I as much as, 
if it as much as crosses my mind to six pill Iris, that's a direct win for me. I don't even gotta try after that, you know? Because, like, your Travis is not gonna go furious on Mr. Dar. It, I mean, on Moses, it's just not. Like, all I need is three pills and it covers you all the way to eight. Or nine, which is what he had before. So, um, yeah, this game uh, could definitely end with a tie if he goes eight sensei. Or this game could just end up as a win for me if he decides to fury sensei. Or just old uh, sensei. Or old Travis. Oh, I think he did the play that gave him the tie. Yeah, he definitely did. Okay. Uh, saved four pills here because uh, of Monty bonus, uh, obviously. So due to some uh, decisions that were poorly made on turn two, probably by me, I should have maybe risked it a little bit more. Like, I don't know. But I really thought he'd cover my win play, but he did. He definitely did not do that. Equalizer. They changed this card. It used to be like what plus fourteen attack, which was it was strong, but it has it had one less power to to make up for it. Uh, Chao, Chao Chu, Chao Chu. Uh. All right, I kind of don't want to trigger his dope, but I think uh, I think we will. I kind of wish I would have gone Mr. Dark here. Not gonna lie, kind of annoying. Kind of annoying that he trip peeled there. When I got Mr. Dark, I could have just ulted there, and you trip peeled for two damage. Okay, good. Uh, yeah. Fulfilling Bella here. The perfect peel here. Very cool. That's alright. That's a win for me. Uh, hold up. Yeah, that's definitely a win for me. Um. Uh, Mr. Dark is actually very strong. This card is ridiculously strong. So, uh, that was a um, great turn too. Yeah, that was definitely a great turn too for me. Um, I know, this deck seems solid. Honestly, quite weak against uh, Soa. But there are so many stop cards uh, running around that honestly I'm barely seeing any Roots or Geist players. Watch, watch Roots player come out as I say that. No, uh, Pussycat though. Pussycat, I looked at it and it seemed a pretty solid choice for the week. I think my deck handles Pussycat just fine. I got Bell, I got Moses, which kind of counter the whole idea. I haven't got Figaro. Um, I know how I feel about Figaro. Like, the card isn't the greatest ever. Maybe I should replace Figaro for Dr. Lisa for more damage. But 
I don't know, Dr. Elisa is one of those cars that it packs such a powerful damage punch, like it does 8 life cap. Uh, Blitz Militia, uh, somewhat expected that, he might be tripling here, uh, he has two life, he has two life um, Manip cards, not Manip, but uh, life dependent cards, so what I want to do here is Breach his HP. I wanna breach his HP because um, I wanna. Yeah, that's right. That's a perfect build, by the way. I want his um, HP cards, HP dependent cards, to be weaker. Definitely do want that. Yeah. I can go Bella here, honestly. I think that's the best. Though I'm never tying with as we as he. That's my stand. That's actually perfect. I'm so glad I got that four damage too, because now with the minus ten, uh, but he has mango, so I kind of gotta do that. Um. He goes mango, so I doubt he covers my yeah, he one peeled. So that's a perfect peel again. So I'm a plus five at the moment. So yeah, I definitely win the game here. Very cool. Whoa, what card is this, my guy? Swear to God, never saw this card. Angora? How? Oh, what? How old is that shit? Angora. Uh huh. Characters, Vortex character. It was released in 2016. Swear to God, never seen it before. Never. Alright. Um, I think we. We could either lead Ikro. Or Figaro. I think I think those are the best leads here. Um Figaro is quite a nice tank. I think it will deter him from playing Diana. Figaro not so much. Um Figure Iker not so much in fair indeed. I mean he might be for peeling Lyanna here. He might be holding Angora. I don't know. We will see. Hopefully not. Hopefully he does not hold Angora. He does not do any kind of double play like that. Maybe five Sarah, I doubt it. But Sarah is quite an interesting card. Uh second round. That's seven life cap. First round, six life cap. Third round, six life cap. Last round, three life cap. That's a problem with some cards. You can't use them the whole game. Alright, we perfect peel our opponent here.
If he goes Angora, he loses the game. Okay, he lost the game. He's forced one pill here, and that gives me the win. Oh, he doesn't even bother one pilling. Uh, so it's like plus six. I need to bring Sarah. Oh, he got one pill back. Hold up. What I'll do is I'll keep Bella, because he has to go Sarah here. So I'll keep Bella on the back for Mango uh, bonus to be inactive. I go Moses here 100%. I can force three pills on Moses, I mean on Sarah, or I'll turn, I just two pill Moses because he'll need to four pill Sarah and that's a loss for him. If he goes four pill Mango, he loses Oh, oh shit, I should have triple Moses. Uh, it doesn't matter. If he goes Mango here, I get to win. Because he can't Fury anyways. So it doesn't matter. I'll kill deal 7 life cap. And I'm at plus 8. So it doesn't even matter. He just shit his pants with a play on turn 2. He went on Gore. That's a direct loss for you. Terrible play. Sorry, my guy. Terrible, terrible play. Uh, Mono Montana, I'm not, uh, I usually don't run Mono in general, but this time around I felt like going, you know, I, I just felt like I'd have some fun with a new deck rather than using half-half as I usually do. Yeah, that was a direct loss for him, turn 2. No matter what he had done, he had lost turn 2 the minute he decided to go that card, you know? Uh, I've seen a lot of these kind of teams too. Like, an upper's half that's very weak to Soa, and then a support like Junta half that's okay against pretty much anything. Uh, Razor is a great card in general this game. Uh, Razor's actually gonna be good no matter what. Iris is gonna be good as well. So I'll keep that in the back and I might go Figaro here even though he has drawn. I might go Figaro. Can go Waller too. I need to tank Chelsea. Ah but it's the feet as well. That's six life cap for a two star card. Uh, victory or defeat. Too bad it's confidence base right but if it wasn't then just forget about it, it would be way too strong. Um, I think I'll just triple Razor here, really. Close to that, tripling Razor. Um, triple Razor forces like 5 pills on Glover. It forces... That's it. Either he goes Glover 5, or he ults Salzburg. There's really no other realistic play to happen here. I could have covered Glover 5, but I think he's so much more likely to go Salzburg than... Because Salzburg is a liability, honestly, for him, so he might just want to get rid of that. And for me to perfect pill a Salzburg, I need to trip pill, which is very annoying. Like, Racer is, is very strong, I mean, like, minus 24 attack, that's no joke. However, due to the nature of the minimum, if you're encountering strong power manip or attack manip, that's negative. So rather than going, rather than saying plus ten, uppers are minus ten. So it's negative attack manip. As such, razor has. It's kind of annoying to use in the way that you kind of, yeah. Like I said, lover five. Either you go that or you ult salts. I don't want a 5 pill to get 4 life cap in case you ult salt. So I'm just going to do that no matter what. Um, so here's the issue here. He knows he can force 2 pills. Easy. He's a plus 5. I can mitigate like 4 out of those plus 5. For sure. He knows I can only fury once.
6 plus 5 is 11. I only need to fear you once. Anyways. So he does not win by winning the round with Helsa. Not quite yet. However, if he can prevent a single fury. Actually, no, bro. No, not even. Because 11 plus 2, that's 13. You'll just get fucked. You'll just get fucked. Yeah, for sure. I think he, if he goes Chelsea, uh, Helsia, Helsa, he just holds. Seven. All right. Out comes my Waller with one kill. That's it. I don't need more than that. He goes five. So my opponent way overpilled there. Like he went way overboard. Because now I just do that. I think my opponent just loses the game here. Because out here, I'll get um, 11 damage through, and thankfully Salzburg is minimum 2, which means I'll end up with 2 HP, and he'll end up with 1 HP, and that's a win for me. So he lost the game turn 2 there. Uh, good game, my guy. Plus 31 as well, not bad. Mono la chunta. All right. Um, thirty-four. Thirty-four. I mean, not thirty-four. Nine plus. No, actually, yeah. Nine. Nine plus um, twenty-four. That's thirty-three. For five, that's five. That's five pills on Clint, Klimt. So, I, I'm just um, I'm just gonna ult dark, I think. Cause if he five pills, right? Or I could five pill Razor. Sixteen five, five six. I could 5 or 6 pill? Razor? Is it really 5 pills? Have I fucked up the map? Yeah, it is 5 pills. Oh, what the fuck? Uh, let me just 6 pill here. Uh, hopefully he doesn't hold or anything dumb like that. 3 pills? That's so dumb, bro. That's so stupid. I can't even begin to explain to you why that was such a terrible play. Like, it doesn't make any sense, bro. Why would you do that, ever? Three, could three pill. Good repeal for sure. 5 plus 7 is 12, minus 1 that's 11. Yeah. Unfortunately, he only 3 pills rather than 5 pilling, which was like his play to make. His play was 5 pill. You don't 3 pill there really ever. You like, you better be holding if you were gonna 3 pill. You might as well hold. Like, Really makes little to no sense to the tree builder. Um, I think I go dark. I all dark here. I all dark here. 
and hopefully he goes to uh, Glover. Because the one kill dark might come out here, like he doesn't know that I'm holding. So he should be trying to cover the one kill dark. He goes eating, which leads me to believe he's he one pills, which is kinda weird. But uh you know what? Sure bro. Uh if I one peel dark I had a guaranteed um tie slash win there. Just to put things in perspective. I'm a plus four, which means that if I go Bella and I win the round, I win the game. I mean, I tie the game. Um, I think this is pretty much a uh, four eight nine. He might want to save three pills. Um, I could just go for the tie rather than. Because he's, yeah, he's three peeling. I could have Fury there, but, um, I could have Fury, but I don't think that would be very wise. He could four peel. Um, he would risk the loss by four peeling, but he risked the loss right there anyways by just not. Oh, I could have gone Ikaru. Because three plus four, that's seven. Ah, oh, no. That gives him, yeah, I was a plus, plus four, so Ikaru is like three life gap. Yeah, never mind. I would not have won by going Ikaru. It would have been exactly the same uh, kind of thing. Look at that, bro. I got uh, Bella here, which is a very useful card for this game. Uh, Razor covers Chell up to 5. Chell is very dangerous this game around. Like, Chell is... Uh, I want to watch out for that card, for sure. Uh, I may lead Bella, but he'll just go uh, Ashy. I think uh, I'd rather go Razor here. Yeah, I might just go Razor here. Uh, Moa is annoying against Razor. But I can go up to 3, I think. And kick up 4. Um, 5 times what? 5 times 5, 25. Yeah, I can just go 5. 6 times 4 is 24 as well, so that works out. Uh, he might just ult here as well, like maybe ult and Ashi. He might be thinking, forcing 3 pills. Um, but that's a pussy play, to be honest. Yeah, that's actually... You're a pussy ass bitch if you just do that play, usually. Like, you don't really do that play most of the time, because it's not good. Because you got Shell and Moai, and I got Bella, so you kind of want to get rid of one of them, at least. However, my open is kind of pussy, so I can just wipe with that. Bella is great for Nabris as well, because he doesn't really get his revenge off, ever, really. I'm a plus four, I'd be a plus two only. Which means Moses is like eight life gap, 
Shell Furious is 10 life cap, so that cannot fly for sure. I think I'll go. What is this here? I think I'll go Moses. Alright. All right. Um, so, unfortunately, round one was fairly bad for me, but... But I pulled with a 50-50 here. So, he all the... He 3 peeled. He predicted peels go turns, which means he might predict peels again. So I'll just hold Bella here. I'm at, I'm at plus nine. So by fearing Shell, he does not win. Uh, my neck hurts like a motherfucker. He lost a 50-50 there. Uh, expect him to predict pills. Plus 22, not bad. Uh, let me check the ranks. Honestly, uh, uh, 2300, so what is that? I definitely want to keep climbing. Oh, we're facing, whoa, that's exactly the same hand uh, we faced before. We have a different hand, but he has exactly the same hand, which is crazy. It's the same guy as well. So, if y'all remember how he played it out, you'll remember that he he covered X, like he covered, like if I go figure here, he's probably 5 billion. I think I'll go Waller though, because no matter where he goes, like he won't deal much life gap. Uh, 2 billion Waller here, honestly. He might go to John though, because John is not that great later on, especially because I got Bella here, and I got Mr. Dark, so you deal no damage pretty much. Um, but he has salts, on the other hand. I never four pill there. I I got three tops. I got three tops. I I you don't four pill there. Uh, people are asking me what are good decks to use. Like most of the time, it's not really the deck. It's just a player. Like people do top one with fucking what vortex frozen decks, which is kind of crap. Like, I, the top one guy was using Mallory, fucking... 
Marjorie, I mean, not Mallory. Like that 8 6 card, you know? Oh, he olded Salzburg. Ah, what a fucking pussy, bro. He should have 2 peel John. What are doing, bro? Like, that's no play. Uh, 2 life cap was up there, though, from that. So, whatever, fool. He might be 5 6 peeling lover. Probably 6. Probably 6. If he 5 or 6 pills here, then what? Actually, he might not be doing that. Alright, Heroes Clover as expected. Sorry, I'm kinda quiet. Um was answering to some stuff. Yeah. You can five pills here. Well let's five pill a figure. Ah damn. That's definitely, that's definitely bad. Uh, yeah, should I guess I should have six pill, but I wasn't expecting such a, a play. I wasn't expecting a six pill, because if I hold, it's kind of, it would be kind of easy for me to guarantee a tie. I'm pretty sure. Anyways, I was talking about checking ranks, and I forgot about that. Um, oh, I'm like eleven. Well, I lost the game now, so I'm I'm like 12 or 13, but I do have to climb. Today is Sunday, which means it's payday. Need to get paid. Need to get paid for sure. Uh, Moses is going to be useful here, because... Because... Uh, because Sabia and Ethan are completely useless. It's probably... Probably. Oh, he goes Ethan. Uh, yeah, he knows I'm going Moses. Might be six billing Ethan. If you want builds, I'm not sure why. Like. Randomly one peeling is not a play. Like it, that's no play actually. That's no play. Um I think I go figure here. I'm gonna go figure I'm, and I'm gonna hold it. Because he's just gonna go savvy here. He's not even gonna bother trying to win the game. He's just gonna go for the luck play. I know this kind of uh, players, like, he won't peel t -tain. Oh, he goes playing. I'm actually surprised. He five pills here. So I know what happens now. Oh god. Oh 
quest to this one peeling waller. Yeah, he didn't fury. The the way he would win the game was by fearing Halsey there. He didn't do it, so now I just win. Um if he tripled Fury, he would have just KO'd me, which would have gave him the win. But he actually went for the... I think he went for the tie, but he didn't realize that Waller actually guaranteed me a win as far as he did in Fury. So, that's great. Great stuff. He had, like, pretty big hand. I want to say 13 stars. I mean, not, I guess not that much. Blaine is a weird card. Like, um, on paper, it's a bad card because it's five damage for a five star card. And, but just the fact that it's a Lajunta card, the five damage isn't really that bad. If it was six damage, I think that card would actually be too strong for Z Palace. So. It's quite balanced, but still, I feel, I feel like it's not worth all the stars it costs, you know, because that shit costs like five stars. And do you really wanna, do you really wanna pay that much for? Absolem's very annoying. God damn, this card is better than you'd think. I think I have a lead figure here. Yeah, I had to mute myself once again because uh, train is <laughs> pretty messing. Uh, good thing I won't build. I was thinking about three pilling, cover like a four pill uh, hoogway or something, but I'm kind of happy I didn't. It's probably seven pilling hoogway here. I'm a plus two at the minute. I'm a plus two. <laughs> you can go eight razor on the seven hoogle. If he, if I truly believe he's seven peeling though, I should just hold because that's a win for me. Even six times three is eighteen. Minus four, fourteen. Seven. Uh, no, that would be 50 50 actually. If he's seven pills and I old, oh, I could just old Razor, I think. Because you get what? Six. Um, you get three plus six. <sighs> three plus six? No. You'd get three plus four life cap, which is seven. You'd get seven life cap. And I get two plus four plus two which is eight so if he's seven pills and i old razor i win the game uh so i think he's seven pilling salt just to them he eight pills so he loses the game here um gg uh, don't overpeel, guys. Don't overpeel. Don't do plays that guarantee yourself a loss.
2336. Yeah, last week I was using Uluwaru plus Hurricane, and it was pretty fine. But this week is not as good as it was last week. Ah, uh, damn. This, my opponent has such a fucking fucked up deck that it might just work. Which is so annoying. <laughs> it's, it, this is actually so annoying. What I can go is Iris, turn 1, because Iris is a great tank, turn 1. I'll 6 spill Iris, because here's the deal, guys. I'm 6 spilling turn 1. That might be an overpill, you might be thinking, but that covers up to 8 Mulkarook and up to 8 Uga. These are both pretty much degrowth cards in a manner that you have to use them on the first two or three round stops. Like even on round three, you're already wasting your card. So you pretty much have to use them on the first two rounds. Especially Boogemon. Because after round two, it just has no power pretty much. Even with his bonus, like it has little power. It, it doesn't hold his own against attack manip like Montana and you're just reducing your own damage as well. Boogemon's a crazy card if you think about it. Like most of the time he's not gonna be as great as you might be thinking. However, well this shitty ass player one pills Lord. That's a terrible play. My man, you have both Muk and Booga to get rid of and you play Lord own turn one Really? Seriously, bro? You're playing Lord turn one. That's a terrible play. You fucking kidding me, dude? What the fuck? I could have three peeled and one legit one turn one. Just straight up win the game turn one. Just cause, you know, you're bad. <laughs> That's the reason. What the fuck, bro? What the actual fuck's going on with you? Boogamon comes out. Five plus nine is fourteen. Damn. I think he's five billion here. He might be six billion though. Yeah, let's go Waller old. Because he might be six billion. Ooh, seven pills. Uh Okay. So I just go dark here. Uh, it doesn't really matter because five, uh, four times three, that's fifteen. All I, all I gotta do is five here. Yeah, that's great. That's a, a win turn two. He overpilled too much. He went seven pills. I was predicting a five pill, so I'm glad I didn't go Moses X, you know, like maybe Moses uh, four, which is what I was thinking. Yeah, he goes Mook here. Like, no, I'm not gonna let you do that, obviously. Mm, so good stuff. Um, that's a win.
Uh, it was looking scary though, but turn two really pulled through. So that's a good win. We've been playing for a while now. We've been playing. I'm not sure where I started the, the video against who, but I've been playing for at least an hour, I think. Uh, I wish OBS would tell me like how long the video is going for. I'm sure there's a way, just don't know how. Ooh, we're facing, um, yeah, we're facing Hurricane. I don't know if cancel opponent power works against power equal power. I, I'm gonna have to ask, does cancel opponent power work against power equal power cards? Question mark? Power equal power cards are not the, the best ever, if I'm being honest. I think I go Icaro here. I mean, Figaro. He's using such a strange kind of deck. Icaro or Figure are probably my best bet. Here's my Riachi. I'm leading Icaro 1. Keep my old Mariachi, then so be it. Tortillo is annoying. I don't have um, like any really good counters against him. Like, I got Figaro, I got Iris, and I guess Mr. Dark. That's it. Those are the cards that easily beat him. But. He has such a weird hand. All he has to do, uh, yeah, like all he has to do is get it right with Tortillo. That's it. P6 builds there. That's, uh, that might help me out actually, since he decided to overpill so much. That's kind of cool. He'll be a plus one. Uh, yeah, it does work. So I'm pretty sure I got a win here. This figure is three life gap. He's a plus one, so he's two. But I can just Fury as well. Um, I just go Mr. Dark here. Figure beats you. Pill per pill. I just go Mr. Dark one here. Mr. Dark pulls through, really pulls through here. He overpeeled too much, and then he messed up turn two by going Noxum Emma. But yeah, Noxum Emma is not a good card. Like, I don't know how to explain. Like, when I see this card, I see my opponent so fucked to get it through. Like, most of the time, you're never gonna get this card to work. Uh, all you, all I need is like a card like Bella or Mr. Dark also renders it useless. It's confidence based, so you can't even use it as a lead or anything like that. What else? Like, yeah, just just about anything stops it on its strength. Like any and and the cards that don't stop it on her tracks. Probably beat her pill per pill, anyways. So it's so strange. It's just so strange that people use it. Like, I don't use it. I'd much rather use the legendary card that they have. Wow. 
why is someone PMing me to up? I don't know what about me tells them I wop. I don't, bro. I, I really do not wop. I don't like wopping. So yeah, we win the game there. I was scared because of Tortillo, but yeah, my opponent just way over Pilter 1, which... <laughs> Damn, someone just <laughs> let a bunch of fucking stuff drop on the ground. Someone shit their pants right there. What's going on? What's going on? All right, just cover his full pill, and that's the win right there. Should be somewhere close to 1400s now. You beat Leto. Was this guy Leto? Yeah, Lenoti, not Leto. Lenodi. That's a cool name. Lenodi Bianchi. Kind of like that name, not gonna lie. So we're 1383. Um, 20 more points and now... Twenty more points and I'll be twenty four hundred. Oh fuck, we're facing this thing. Raptor is uh not the greatest uh not the greatest against my deck, I must say. Let's go Moses, uh bait Nidori. Go five Nidori. I'm six five that's sixty. Minus twelve forty eight. That's good. Seven times six. That's forty two. I need to seven pill. 7 pill and Moses covering 5 pill Nidori. He might want to go Nidori here just because um, I got Mr. Dark and he's a degrowth card. So oh, out comes Nidori. Nido, Hopefully 5 pills. 3 pills. Uh, okay, less than expected, but still fine. Razor's dead. It's fair to say Razor's not going to do a lot here. I got Figaro, I can rely on. Uh, one of these cards will do two damage, two plus seven. He should cover. He should go four here. He should theoretically he should go four pill meme. Cause if I five pill my figure, you're gonna lose. So let's see. Let's old razor really quick. Okay, he ults weirdly enough. Um, 5 times 3, 15 plus 5, ah, that's terrible, I lost the game. I just assumed he would cover 5 figure, because that's, you know, that gives me the win. Uh, what's this guy name? A uh, Garen Deal CR, so for future reference, we know that guy does not think about losing the game, he just thinks about holding, or... Uh, covering the bare minimum, you know. Uh, ooh, mono. Oh, it's this guy again. Oh, Salo, running the mono. Uh, Fanfic lane. Scary stuff. Scary scuff. Uh, scuff. What? <laughs> Hello. All right, I'll stop now. Mamba's annoying against me. Mamba's really annoying. I might lead the uh, Figaro or Mr. Dark. More Figaro, so more so than Mr. Dark. Five. Did you go for it? Let's go. Let's do pill.
I wanna fart so much. I'm sorry, you guys. Ooh, what was that? Three pill? Oh, we perfect pill there. Very good. Five life cap. Mr. Dark is actually, hands down, my favorite card in this deck. There's rarely any situation in which he's not useful, which is insane. He's baiting me hard here. I think he's six billion, right? Uh, six plus five is eleven plus one. That's twelve. He has five plus six. That's eleven. He needs the fury once. He need. He has two plus two pills here, though. So that's twelve pills minus three from the fury. That's nine. How can I guarantee myself a good spot against a nine pilled guy that's using this shit? I think I can afford to 6 pill here. Yeah, hopefully he doesn't 7 pill, but I wouldn't expect that. I would ex. Mm. Should just hold it. Should just hold it. Why still pill? Why still pill here? Out comes Mambo. Uh, I lose the game here, sadly. This is probably one of the few games where I've seen Kim Kuni's last turn. But yeah, GG, GG there, GG. Turn 2, that's a GG turn 2, because I didn't hold, if I hold it, that would have been just a win for me, obviously. I would expect him to predict the 3 or 4 pill, much more so than the 6 pill. Oh, this shit again, come on, what's up with people using raptors now, do I have to change decks? Like, I've lost, what, 2 games in a row? Yeah. That's terrible. I dropped 70 points from losing two games in a row. Fucking great. Great shit, dude. I'm so happy with that. Fuck you. Fuck you. If I lose one more, I'm finishing the, the video. I can be asked. Mulligan is a bad lead, but I can see him leading. I'd much uh, more see him go. Kruger, though. I think he 2 pills Kruger, which makes me want to 3 pill Figaro, but yeah, let's do that. 3 pill in Figaro. Why would you 3 pill? I got 
Waller, bitch! I got fucking Waller, you kidding me, bro? You have to be shitting my pants right now. Fucking what? Fucking what you're billing it, Kruger? Have you seen my hand? Have you seen my motherfucking hand, dude? I got Iker and Waller. I gotta get rid of one of those from one. Pretty much guaranteed. And you fucking triple Kruger? What are you, retarded? Jesus fucking Christ, bro. What the fuck is that shit all about? 5 plus 4 is 9. I got 9 as well. 3, 4. Men's annoying. Might just 1 pill. Don't keep my old. That's so shit. Meme's so fucked against me too. It's so fucked how strong that card is against me. Fucking fucked. Why are you using, using Raptors? Everyone's using fucking All-Stars and shit. Your Raptors are Iron Jack shit. God damn. Fucking annoys the shit out of me, bro. If he 4 pills liable, he loses the game, so hopefully he does that. He shouldn't do that, because that's a direct loss if I 5 pill, but let's see. Just watching 5 pill anyways, like... I see what happened. Huh? Three pills? Two? He two pills level? Are you fucking retarded, bro? Are you actually fucking retarded, bro? How are you gonna two pills level? Now it costs a 50 50, dude. Now it costs a fucking 50 50. Oh, damn, you must love that, huh? Just random pills all the time. Yeah, it costs 50 50s. Seven, seven. Seven, I get six. Ah, that's not 50 50. That's a loss, huh? Shit. I'm disgusted, dude. I am fucking disgusted. Yeah, unless he messes up, I just lose. He underpilled a lot. Yeah, he won't pills, okay. How is the game? I just, I'm just gonna fucking give up on the video, I guess. Because what the fuck, why am I losing so much? These fucking retards are making me lose games like hell. Like, what the fuck is that? Triple Kruger turn one? That's no fucking play, bro. Fucking give up on this shit. Facing Raptors? Like, what the fuck? Raptors is not even a clan that you use this week. What the fuck? Everyone's using Mono All-Stars. Your Raptors ain't shit. I'm done.